Let's move on to another case for global connectivity, for moving things. In this case, I have this Fast Transport Inc. Uh, uh, transport company. If we first look at how they would do this typically today with existing solutions, is that they would have an APM to their mobile operator, and they have this agreement with one mobile operator. And then they would probably have the roaming charges that is quite heavy between many countries to enable connectivity between countries like this. And note that all this traffic is home routed. So there is no local breakout of the traffic anywhere. And that adds latency, etc. So the bottom line here is that you get the quite costly global roaming and probably you only have a few predefined policies that you can play with. Let's now look at the same solution enabled by Aptilo IoT CCS. You still have one MNO agreement like this over the Aptilo IoT CCS. But then we can provide international APNs, which is a huge benefit through this service, or the mobile operator can can offer this. It's not Aptilo that does that. We only offer the two to make it happen. And as the mobile, as the track now moves from Canada in this case down to the US, the mobile operator can do a switch to the local mobile operator over the, with an over the air activation like this. And no, this is have something, uh, nothing to do really with IoT CCS. They can do that anyway, and it's another tool that do that. But the combination between sim localization like this and, and the Aptilo IoT CCS is enormous. And then it moves to Mexico, and same thing. It switched to the next mobile operator. And I must uh, confess that it's kind of ridiculous having a truck going from Canada to Brazil, but I didn't want to mess up my slide by, by having individual countries in the Central America. So I let this uh, truck now go the ridiculous long way to Brazil. But I think you get my meaning anyway. And now you switch to the local operator in Brazil. And note that you may have initial roaming if the policy is switched to just switch the operator after X hours or X number of bytes or something like that. So initially you may roam and then you switch the operator. And you can do policy-based local breakout through the, the implementations we have in the Aptilo IoT CCS. And what this gives is a global APM. You have the possibility to do granular policy and connectivity and security policies. So this is a total different service compared to the first, as you can see, and a very innovative way of, of uh, selling IoT services. And I think you can guarantee that the customer that gets this and really needs it they, they will be very sticky. 